Good day, good day, good day, my people, what a gun. Welcome aboard Panicana TV. There once again, it's another review. Yeah, man, they had a whole hip-hop passa passa. Anyway, make we get tonight. Hip-hop superstar Cardi B attacks Nicki Minaj at New York's Fashion Week. Hip-hop superstar rapper Matt Miller found dead after apparent drug overdose. Alkaline for your shots at Bounty Kill and Ragin King in new Dirty Bad Mind. It's single. Post Malone walks uninjured after serious car crash. Hip hop superstar Cardi B attacks Nicki Minaj at New York's Fashion Week. Witness says Cardi B attacks Nicki Minaj while she was in the middle of a conversation on the second floor balcony during Christina Aguilera's performance at the plaza. At one point, Cardi tried to throw a shoe at her. Security stopped Cardi and neither of the New York natives was seriously injured. Cardi B was escorted outside while Nicki Minaj was still inside. Later on we saw where Cardi B emerged with a bruise over her eye. Wow. But anyway, Cardi B and Nicki Minaj getting her some passa passa. You know the miggle at the big show. Now that no look good my people, you see me? Cardi B try to step to Nicki Minaj. Eventually throw her shoes off her, shout couple words off her and thing and thing and till security have to get involved. Take her outside and later on we see Cardi B surface with a bruise over one of her items. So we're not really too sure what took place right there. So make we move on. Hip hop superstar rapper Matt Miller found dead after apparent drug overdose. Wow. The rapper has been discovered dead at his California home. 26 year old who was open about his substance abuse died from an apparent overdose. Law enforcement sources tell media reports that the platinum selling rapper was found at around noon at his San Francisco Valley home and was pronounced dead at the scene. Authorities were alerted by a male who made a 911 call, presumably from Max's home. Wow, what a story. So, this is the rapper get found dead in California house and they have it for a drug overdose. But we have to say over here so on Pandicana TV, we have to say R.I.P. to the artists and condolences to the family and friends and, you know, condolences to the fans and followers. But anyway, more want the eye them leave them comment because you can see the artists, them say them found him dead in California house and, you know, the authorities were informed. The authorities was informed about this by some male that was apparently at the artist's house. So we don't really do know what take place, but we are record for the report them say. And also no can like and comment and you know yeah man, leave no comment, make you know nothing about this. And remember to share the post them and also subscribe to the channel for more news and reviews. Anyway, make you move. Alkaline for your shots at Bounty Kill and Ragin King in new Dirty Bad Mind It single. Alkaline has released a new It single called Dirty Bad Mind, allegedly firing shots at Bounty Killer and Ragin King. The arms of record produced single sees Alkaline responding to Bounty Killer after the fed up DJ labeled him a freakazide. On the track, Alkaline charges at critics, uttering that they can't confront him, and as a result, he don't care if they want to hate him. All right, my people, so we see where Alkaline step forward, produce a new single. We go up to the Arms House Record Music Company. Yeah, them and Alkaline come together and produce this single, yeah. Song called Dirty Bad Mind. And we can see where my take shots. A couple artists, you know, some people have it for say my fire shot off a bounty killer. And some people have it for say my also a fire shot off a ragging king. When I have to say no, people don't leave no comments, they make me know what I think. But yeah. You know the song Alkaline say boy, we know really business what them want to talk say you know cause all them can talk and talk and talk, none of them can confront him and furthermore, none of them can confront him so he don't really care if they want to eat him, you see me, because I just did so thing that you see me, I that the boss say. So anyway, big up to the whole Vendetta camp, appreciate the work, big up to Rygan King, big up to Bounty Killer also, big up to the whole of the music fraternity, yeah man, big up to Rygan King and continue to put out the work same way to my brother, you don't know the thing go. We appreciate the hard work. Anyway, my people, like, subscribe, share the thing them now. Pan the corner TV with them, you know. Tell your friend them about the channel where I rock the place. And also, once again, I want to say big up to Hype Life magazine for the information once again. 
Post Malone walks uninjured after serious car crash. Wow. Post Malone says, God must hate me after he was involved in a car crash in Beverly Hills, California. The chart-topping artist Rolls Royce crashed into a Kia in West Hollywood. Then it offends and was stopped by some shrubs. The Rolls Royce belonged to Post Malone but it was being driven by his assistant while the rapper sat in the passenger seat. There are no injuries reported and according to preliminary investigation, no alcohol was involved. I want to say big up to the artist and we're glad to make it out of the car crash and injured. And also the, um, the driver and injured. So, yeah, man, big up to the artist, the man. John, you know, take time with the vehicle, the man. You know, just have to be careful out there, you see me? Yeah, man, because the road mad, you know. Yeah. But anyway, I think I hit that for you, you know. So, until next time, remember to like, subscribe, and share the video, the man. Tell on the people, them to like the channel also, and subscribe and click the bell. So you can get the notification then when the feed them are coming. So may I deal with yeah man on a big up on yourself no. Have a great weekend. Whoever wanna do, do it safe on the corner TV at gmail.com. Manners and